Okay, this is going to be an unboxing video of this fuel transfer pump I just received. This is not a sponsored video. It's just going to be a quick unboxing and we'll go outside and we'll hook it up to a gas can and see how it works. I found this on an advertisement on a YouTube video I was watching. Most times I do skip them, but uh, this one definitely seemed interesting. And yesterday, actually, a neighbor has an identical pump, but it's uh, two years old. He says it works perfectly and one of the best investments he's uh, ever made. He is disabled and he can't lift the uh, gas cans up to fill up the uh, riding lawnmower or any other equipment. Me personally, it's difficult to fill the rear tanks on the Craftsman's and on just about any machine, especially holding a uh, gas can. So I figured give this a try. It was cheap enough to get anyways. And if I can, if I remember, I will leave a link in the description below. Okay, here's the inside of the box. It does include batteries, which is nice. It comes with three different sizes for different gas can sizes. Your actual pump right here and your hose. This does have auto shut off. So I guess whenever it reaches the top, there's a sensor in here that will shut it off just like a gas pump at a gas station. Uh, on the advertisement for this, the guy was mentioning the other pumps that are similar and some of them are even more expensive don't have auto shut off. This one here is under $100 and it has auto shut off which is definitely a nice feature. So say if you turn your back for a second, you're not going to dump a whole bunch of gas on the ground or all over your machine which is nice to have. The main reason also why I bought this is so I can pump out fuel tanks like the uh, generator. As once a month I pump the generator out or once to say once to every other month I pump the generator out and I put 100% fresh fuel back in the generator having this will make it nicer to um, drain the generator out I won't have to mess with the fuel lines and wear out the fuel lines here is just a quick view of the owner's manual there is the model number up there and it's a quick view of the owner's manual as well this here just tells you how to put it together and the features and everything else you need to really know about the item. Back here, your warranty and your do not do stuff and all the typical boilerplate stuff that if you end up being an idiot with it, they're not going to cover you. But really, how can they prove that you're being an idiot with it? Nice thing is it comes with name brand batteries, Energizer. So it's not like cheap Chinese knockoff batteries, which is definitely nice. Okay, here is the actual pump itself. The batteries go in here. You have your on off switch right here. This end here goes down into your gas can. So you can definitely use a fairly large um, gas can with this. And here is your um, film nozzle. And you have a couple clamps on here. So you can clamp this on to the um, actual uh, the item you're filling up. And this will fit in there nice and tight. So you don't have to worry about this flying out on you when you are filling your gas tank. Definitely a nice feature and like I said it comes with three different adapters So next video is we'll have this on a gas can and we will attempt to fill up a tank I have a machine out back that does need a uh, topping up of fuel and we'll see how this works So I'll talk to you later. Please give it a red neck like always and uh, please comment